G'day guys, Fitcho here, and today I am bringing challenges back to the channel, kicking it off with the blindfold challenge, something I haven't done in over a year, and we're going to be doing it around the streets of Monaco here on F1 2017 using the McLaren MCL 33 mod. I did a video on this mod yesterday, so check that out if you haven't already seen it. I absolutely love this livery, and this mod does it justice. It is absolutely beautiful. So, the aim of this challenge is to complete one lap in time trial while wearing this blindfold, so I can't see where I'm going. So I have to go off memory and my track knowledge of Monaco to get myself around. Let's get into it. Right, here we go. We're on track in time, Charles. Just coming around the last couple of corners here in Monaco. And once we get onto the pit straight, open the DRS and the blindfold will come down as we cross the start finish line. So now I can't see a thing. So we go down to third, turn it into Sandovot, back on the power and this has not gone well at all. I can already tell. I'm trying to think of, I think we're probably gone straight on into the wall. So we want to go down a few gears, get it right down into reverse. That should be enough. And back it out of this wall. Let's try to here. No, I've just, I think I've just backed into a wall. So if I get back into first, let's go there and give it a little bit of power. Give it a bit of a spin and go up this way. No, no, we're still in a wall. I can tell by the sound, but it's revving it in the wall. So let's just try it. Reversing, reverse, reverse, keep reversing, right, now let's try first, and turn to the right a little bit, no, that's another wall, where are we? Oh, I've actually got around Sandovot, sort of, okay, I think, yeah, you can call that around Sandovot, so let's just get out of this wall quickly, and straighten it up, alright, blindfold back on, that's one peak, and now we head up, Beau Ravage, up through the gears. This kinks a little bit, and I can't remember how it kinks, and I can tell by all the contact it's not going well. Right, Massine. We're through Massine, just wall riding now into Casino. There's a hit on the left, so I think we should be heading down towards Mirabeau now. Down into sec. That didn't sound good. Okay, we're going straight into a wall somewhere. I think we're down near Mirabeau. I think. I could be so, so wrong right now. I have no idea. So we're just going to back it out of the wall. And we should be out of the wall by now. Back on the brake. Let's put it up into first gear. And turn right into Mirabeau. No, we're still on a wall. I can tell. That does not sound good. We're definitely still on a wall. Right. Yeah, let's back it out of here. Alright, okay. Okay, now we try going this way. No, that's back into a wall. I think there's a wall on my right. So let's actually reverse it this way. What if we go a little bit left? I have no idea where I am. I am at Mirabeau. I was right. I somehow got down to Mirabeau. I'm not sure how I managed to get down to Mirabeau, but I did. So let's straighten the car up. Blindfold back on. Now we're heading down to the hairpin. I've hit the wall on the right. This is... Oh, oh, this is not going well. You wouldn't think it would be that difficult to get from Mirabeau down to the hairpin, but it clearly is very, very challenging. So let's... Okay. I'm just having a listen, see what I can hear, and I think we're still on a wall. So that, I think... Am I in a wall on the right? I think I am. So let's, let's reverse this way. Okay, I just felt a hit on the rear right, I think it was. So let's get back into first, and now we should be able to go straight. No, we're hitting something. We're still on the wall. Where the... Oh. Okay. We're, we're perpendicular to the track. That's... That's not ideal. That is not where you want to be. Right. Okay. I've got the hairpin. This, this should be easy. I should be able to navigate this. It shouldn't be a real challenge. Move forward. Go to lock. And just tippy-toe around here. Open up the steering. As now we head down to this no-name right-hander. Flick it in. I hear contact on the left, so I'm going to assume we've got through that corner. It's now down to Portier. No, no, no. We're in a wall. I am at Portier, though. Can I get in behind this wall? Yes, I can. That's very strange. You can get in behind a wall there. Right, right. Okay, okay. Let's straighten the car back up. Tunnel. This should not be a difficult part of the track. We go straight, a little kink to the right, straight again. And then it's hard on the brakes. How hard can that be, right?
through the kink. Out the other side. And now down to the brakes for the Nouveau Chicane. Back on the power. Oh, I heard a lot of wheel spin there. And a lot of contact with walls. I'm going to go down a fair few gears. Let's get down to reverse. Neutral first, right? Okay, now let's drive. No, we're in a wall. Okay, back into reverse. Let's back it out. I think we're sort of... The wall's here and we're sort of in like that, is what I think, from what I can feel. So if we turn a bit to the right, we should be able to get out of this. Wait, what gear am I in? Let's go into reverse. Neutral first. Bit of steering to the right. And straighten up. I can still feel a wall to my right. Wait, maybe we're head... Uh, this is... Okay, okay, let's go reverse. Let's just back it right out of here. Um, no, I don't want to peek just yet. And now, there's a wall in front of us to the left slightly, I think. So if we... Wait, maybe we've gone straight down through the new El Chicane. We've gone to that runoff area. So maybe we have to go left. Maybe. So we go left. Then we go back to the right. And now we sh should be head... No, no, where are we? Oh, I thought I was over there, sort of where the uh, red and white uh, things are. But no, I'm... Okay. Okay. Okay, this is... Let's just flick this car around. Too much. Straighten the car up. That's just... Yep, on the racing line. Right, now we just have to head down two to back. Out of the new box you can we go. Second, third, fourth, fifth. Fourth, turn it in. No, there's so much contact. That's a spin. Definitely a spin. I think we're facing the wrong way. So we go back into reverse, into first, plant the throttle, flick it around, back on the brake, straighten up, and now drive. Hopefully we're facing the right direction. Now into the swimming pool section we go. No, that's a wall we're in. Right, we should be in reverse. Let's back it out. The wall sort of on my rear left, I think I can feel. If we go slightly to the left here. No. It's a wall in front of us, maybe. So let's just get reverse. No, that's not working. Okay, wait. On the apex of to back. Okay, this. Yeah, there's no chance of getting out of there with without looking. I have to fucking three point turn it. Okay, okay. Here we go. We're we're getting towards the final stretch here. We've just got the swimming pool, grass cast, and anti nodes to go. So into the swimming pool we go. And no, I've. I have no idea where I am now. I've just, yeah. I turned in so early for the swimming pool, I just, yeah. Right. I have no idea which way I'm facing. Let's see if I can. Which way is my wheel? There. Okay. Get down into reverse. Alright, that's reverse, surely. Neutral first. Right. Let's give it a little bit of power. Right, we're moving. No, we're not. We're definitely not moving. Back into reverse. Let's try backing out of the wall. Okay, a lot more success. I felt a wall there. So maybe we we're in a in a wall like that and we'll reverse like that. So we go that way. Get out like that. So reverse, neutral first. A little bit of steering to the left. And get us out of here. Oh, that was working. But I felt something on the right. Maybe we're in the swimming pool section right now. So we need to go a little bit left, and then back to the right. No, where am I? Oh, I've made it to the chicane. I thought I was still at the fast bit. I made it further than I thought I had. Right, okay. I've actually made it through that chicane. We've only got two corners to go. Come on, we're almost there. Right, let's go. Into Raskas. Doesn't feel like that's gone well. No, that has not gone well. Back into reverse. I'm trying to think of which wall I might be in. I've, I feel like I'm in the wall on the right. So if we reverse this way, get us out. Oh, that was the rear left hitting a wall. So now if we go a bit to the left, we can straighten this car out. It should be in line with the track again. I'm hearing contact on the right, on the left, I should say. So we turn around, Raskas. No. Oh. Okay, the wheel pulled a lot there, so maybe that was the middle of, of Raskas there, where the wall turns a lot. So now we should be heading straight to Anthony Nodes. 
or not. I don't even know. I have no idea where I am. Wait, no, no, no. Okay, I'm in a wall now. Okay, I'm in a wall. I can get out of here. Let's get into reverse. Just back this thing out. Slowly. Slowly does it. And turn to the right. No, where am I? Oh, I'm so close to anti nodes. I'm like, I turned in like a meter or two too early. Right, okay. So, okay. I'm, I'm just sort of calculating how I'm going to take this corner without watching. Sort of planning it in my head. So, get into reverse. Into first. Straight. Now turn. No, we're not around. No, we've, we've hit the inside wall, didn't we? We've spun it around, so... Right, I'm going to try to get it out of this corner. Like, yeah, it shouldn't be too hard to get out of here. And now straighten up. That's the DRS. Onto the straight. And we should be about to complete a lap. Although I can't really tell. Yes, we've completed a lap. We've done it. Only took us 10 minutes and 18 seconds. That's not the worst lap of Monaco ever, I don't think. Right, there we go. That was the blindfold challenge. I managed to complete a lap of Monaco without being able to see. I did have to check a couple times to see where I was. There would have been a peak counter on the screen somewhere for you guys to watch. I have no idea how many times I picked. I stopped counting. But there will be a count on the screen. 10 minute lap time around Monaco. Um, it's not exactly a pole time, is it? No, it's not ideal, but I managed to survive the lap. Although damage was off, and if it was on, I wouldn't have survived the lab. But anyway, we survived 10 minutes. That's not too bad. I hope you guys did enjoy the video. I'm definitely going to be doing a few more challenges on the channel. I find them a lot of fun to do. Just do some stupid stuff on racing games. It's a nice change from the serious sort of racing that I usually do. So if you've got any challenges you want to see me do, make sure you do comment them down below. But that's going to do it for today, guys. If you guys did enjoy the video, make sure you do leave a like on the video. Of course, if you're new to the channel, make sure you do subscribe for much more F1 content. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you all next time.